Bona tarda a tothom, benvinguts. Magnífics rectors de la Universitat Autònoma de Barcelona i de la Universitat Pompeu Fabra, patrons, president of the Barcelona Graduate School of Economics, graduates, faculty members of the BGSE, families of the graduates, ladies and gentlemen. It is a great pleasure to join you, your family and friends, the faculty and the institution as a whole, in celebrating the achievements of this very special day. Graduations like the one we are celebrating today are unique among the milestones of our lives. They are a celebration of your past accomplishments, but more importantly, they do represent an important first step into your new future. As a matter of fact, not only into your future, but in the future of all of us. As I am sure that in one way or another, all of you will contribute to the shaping of our society in the years to come. Moreover, this is a very special graduation ceremony as you are the first class to graduate from the Barcelona Graduate School of Economics. I am pleased to offer all of you my warmest congratulations and support. I would also like to thank the uh, Barcelona GSE for this opportunity to address you today. Please allow me to comment for brief moments on both Caixa Forum and Barcelona hosting us today. Caixa Forum Barcelona is one of the outstanding centers of our social welfare activities at La Caixa. Please allow me to comment that we actually rank number five, number five at world level. level. It is a facility devoted to cultural exchanges of all kinds, including, for example, our latest series of conferences on the impact of economic globalization or the forthcoming exhibition of the Czech artist Alphonse Mucha, which we will be inaugurating soon. Moreover, supporting education has always been among the main priorities for La Caixa, and it continues to be at the center of our social welfare activities. Not only are we founding partners of the Barcelona GSE, but we are also running a long-standing prestigious scholarship program, giving support to more than 100 students for graduate studies abroad since 1982. This year, we added a two-year scholarship program that aims to attract international talent to four of the most outstanding biomedical research centers in Spain. It is, hence, a great honor for me to be the keynote speaker in the first graduation ceremony held by the Barcelona GSE. Although this is a young institution, it is already recognized as a school that focuses first and foremost on academic excellence. With its world-class faculty and all of you, an outstanding international student body, I am sure that the Barcelona Graduate School of Economics will quickly become one of the most recognized graduate schools in the world, and it must be. Moreover, it is an important addition to the city's vibrant, vibrant academic and research community, and will allow Barcelona to consolidate its outstanding position as a center of excellence in educating the leaders of tomorrow both in business administration and economics. And in one way or another, from today onwards, you will be ambassadors of the Barcelona GSE, and of course, of our beloved city. With your knowledge, effort, and commitment, you will promote the school and decisively contribute to its development. As you succeed in your personal and professional projects, 
the school will succeed and increase its recognition as a school where talent is developed, which in turn benefits you as alumni of the institution. Now it is your time, your time. It is time to deploy all you have learned during these intense nine months. In a few days, you will start a new stage in your lives. Some of you may extend your studies into a PhD program. It's okay. Others will directly enter the labor market. It's okay. <laughs> but what's next? What's next? What else is important apart from the technical and scientific skills you acquired during your stay here? How do you make best use of so much valuable time you have invested over the last year? Your time and the one of all the people that have been around you, your families, your professors, the school's administration, the tutors, etc. As you leave the school, you will join a global world going to a global world. We are not in a global world at this particular moment. Not yet. Perhaps we will never be there. You only need to have a quick look at your class. Over 90% of your classmates are from abroad and come from 31, 31 different countries. Today, with new technology available and political barriers lower than ever, the world economies are highly interconnected and the degree of integration is ever increasing. This integration process is the result of a very high level of mobility of people, goods, services, and knowledge. All of them are easily transferred every day from one part of the world to another. This holds especially true of financial capital flows, technology or know-how, but also although to a lesser extent, of talent. You are a brilliant example for this increasing mobility of global talent, and I do encourage you to stay open-minded, mobile and flexible, as it is an important part of your value proposition for any institution you might work for, be it in the academic, world or as a business career.